Hi, I'm Mark Antonacci, and for the last 32 years, I've had the privilege of studying a comprehensive amount of evidence relating to the cause of the unique frontal and dorsal body images and their corresponding blood marks encoded throughout a burial garment known as the Shroud of Turin. Most of this evidence is objective and independent, deriving from the general fields of science and medicine. Although this extensive evidence has never been duplicated, it clearly shows that a man incurred a series of wounds, was crucified and killed, and then wrapped in this cloth. While the man appears to have been buried according to detailed Jewish burial customs, his body left the cloth in a mysterious manner within two to three days. All of these events appear to have occurred in the same manner and under the same circumstances as the historical Jesus Christ. Thousands of scientific tests have been performed on this burial cloth and its samples, but only one result is controversial radiocarbon dating of 1988 is inconsistent with the cloth's authenticity as Jesus' burial garment. This result has recently been challenged by scientists at the University of Padua in Italy who obtained an average date of 33 BC using three different methods to date the fibers from the shroud. The provenance of these samples and the ones used to radiocarbon date the shroud has been questioned. Our Test the Shroud website discusses examining the shroud, its blood and other samples at the molecular and atomic levels, which could determine the source of all dated samples. Moreover, this website examines the leading scientific hypothesis for how the shroud's unprecedented body images and other features were uniquely encoded by a particular form of radiation emanating from the body wrapped within it. This event also explains how the cloth erroneously dated to the Middle Ages. Molecular and atomic technology could test all proposed explanations for the shroud's radiocarbon dating and its unique images, from naturalistic to artistic to miraculous. This technology could independently reveal the shroud's actual age, the identity of the man buried within it, if it is a forgery, and whether a miraculous event occurred to the dead body wrapped within it. This new information, combined with what science has already learned, could indicate that every element of the passion, crucifixion, death, burial, and resurrection of the historical Jesus Christ occurred as described in the Gospels.